this Ruston Old Vicarage garden is a wonder at this time of year. So many compartments of individual styles and plantings, some of which feed through in all the areas of the garden, others which are very stylized. And the area around the house with the seating areas, the old conservatory, lean-to greenhouse, and orangery is one of my favorite parts. What a wonderful English garden they've created here with long vistas all around it. These greenhouses are stuffed full of geranium and pelargoniums. Some rose growing on the back there, a little bit mildewy. I don't think it's really liking the heat, but it must have been spectacular earlier in the season. And the seating areas they've created around the house really feel enclosed despite this being a very large garden it's all broken into smaller areas each with their individual character each with an individual feel and uh, particular planting some of which are just when you get close up so cleverly done really clever this despite being in a courtyard your eyes immediately drawn down these long avenues that run from the area immediately surrounding the house quite a short parterre garden here with very formal clip box and a dark backdrop very little color other than just the contrasting shades of green but then to your right a massive long vista going down probably 200 yards, gravel pathway beyond the pagoda, extending right the way down towards the fountain gardens to my left and the herbaceous on my right. It's easy to overlook some of the structural and architectural features that have been put into this garden. Sheer scale and beauty of some of them are sometimes overshadowed by the plantings that are in them. Everywhere you explore there's a new vista drawing you through into the next segment of the garden. Just look at that. Just makes you want to walk through and go and sit. And I'm sure the view back will be equally enticing. There's lots of seating areas put cleverly into all these compartmental gardens. These hedges must be 12 to 15 feet tall and an enormous workload just keeping them looking so good. Central sections being quite recently planted with young red aces probably repeating the effect and planting of this one just to my right running right the way over this bench like seat that I'm on even growing under it if that's repeated here then the whole effect under these cleverly clipped upright trees within this courtyard is going to give a very structured very beautiful effect Back towards the house, clip box, formal holly in the centre, golden yellow and a wonderful wisteria just drooping down in front of the leaded windows of the old vicarage. This is the main viewpoint from the house, looking almost due south down the Norfolk coast and behind me a wonderful old vicarage itself sitting very well in this planting of clipped you even got the striped lawn how fully country garden is that